Greetings, gentlemen and ladies. If you have a problem like this, you've imported a character into your game and you got no textures. Now, I've downloaded my character from Sketchfab and he's supposed to have textures. Well, he doesn't have textures. Here's how we're going to fix this. Okay, let's go ahead and do our import. Now, I've downloaded my FBX model and I've put everything into the same folder, even though the textures and the FBX came in separate folders. That doesn't really matter because it's not going to really find it anyway. So that's that's kind of the point. That's what we're going to fix here today. I'm going to actually grab the uh, FBX model and actually I'm going to put that into its own folder. I'm going to call that Cameraman because apparently I know some of these characters now. My son has been educating me. Uh, I'm going to import. I'm not going to import with a skeleton. This character is not rigged to the Unreal Engine mannequin or anything like that. Uh, I am going to want to create new materials here, right? Uh, so I'm just going to go ahead and click on import. And from here, what we will have is the problem that you're probably experiencing. If you're watching this video, we got our character imported, but no textures, right? We got no textures. That's, that's not right. Uh, he's supposed to look like that. He doesn't look like that. All right, here's how to fix this. So I'm going to go ahead back to my my uh, folder where I had my FBX. I'm going to grab the three individual texture images. I'm just going to drag those in somewhere that makes me happy. Now if you're getting an error, fail to re-import, etc, etc. Now that has to do with a duplicate file name. So what I'm actually going to go ahead and do is I'm just going to create a new folder within here. Call that textures and now I'm going to actually put all the textures in. I probably should have done that in the first place. There we go. Now we're talking. Now we got all our textures. That's just a file name. Even though this is a, a texture and this is a material, uh, the uh, file naming of Unreal Engine is for some. This this tricked me for a while, but uh, for some reason it it seems to get confused, you know, about all that. So I'm going to delete that extra texture. I'm just going to have all my textures in one folder, and uh, not try to solve the mysteries of of Unreal Engine's logic system at the moment. Now my uh, model has a skeletal mesh. In my skeletal mesh this is actually going to be kind of helpful because uh, what it's got here is a bunch of different material slots. Uh, so I'm going to be looking around for a couple of the pre of the created materials like this that happen to match the file name of the actual texture images. So I've got this one here called Surveillance Camera. Right, so I've also got this material that was created called surveillance camera. Now, if I open up this material, I can see that it's just assigned the default color. Right, so here's what we do: we're going to go and we're going to head to our textures, and we're going to actually grab the uh, what was it called again? Surveillance camera texture, and we're going to drag that te texture map in, map in and put that into the base color. Like so, you can delete the the default blank color that was there before go ahead and click on apply click on save and now when we go back well we've got the camera in place I believe yeah I think I think we, we textured that let's check out the suit that's going to be a fairly noticeable difference so uh, in our suit sheet is what we got here suit sheet so we're going to be looking for the one called suit sheet and I'm just going to go ahead and grab a suit sheet put that in like so and I'm going to put that in like that. Delete that because I don't need it. Click apply. Click save. Head back to my level. Oh, looking much better already. What's the last one? We got gloves. All right, gloves. And where's the gloves? Do we, do we have arms and gloves? Hmm. Maybe it's under arms and gloves. I don't know. Let's try arms and gloves. I'm going to delete the gloves here. And uh, let's see. See if the gloves were the right one. Click on apply, click on save, and you know what, I think I think that was right. Let's see what it's supposed to, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what, I think that was right. Okay, so, well, now you know. If the file name doesn't match up, make a, make a good guess and, and hope for the best. Anyway guys, hope you have found this video helpful. If you like this video and you want to see more content tutorials like it, feel free to hit up my Patreon. Unfortunately, YouTube has demonetized this channel for most unrighteous reasons. I won't get into that, but if you want to support this channel, uh, Patreon's the way to do it. Thank you guys. See you in the next video. All right.
Oh wait, I didn't hit stop. All right. Oh, what the hell? All right. 